My name is Tom, and I'm a film student uh, in Stafford University in Stafford. Um, it's my first year. I've made a few films already. The first year, there's a lot of work to do. Uh, um, uh, I've I've been in horse for three years and every year I get new flatmates yeah. which is kind of interesting. Well we meet up at the Christian Union each week. Um, often I'll just come over and sit and talk with Tom in his flat and recently I'm doing uh, web design with Tom because he's setting up a website and I do web design as a hobby. When I'm about, it's usually walking around town and exploring the shops or stuff like that. Wheelchair access in the university is pretty good on the whole. I haven't really had much problem. Uh, going around town and stuff, it can be a bit hard in times because people do uh, park in front of the rampways and stuff from the pavements, which has meant we've had to backtrack quite a bit sometimes. Yeah. My name's Doug, Doug Mason, and I'm, I'm a note-taker. I'm employed as a note-taker uh, with Tom, although there's a little bit more than just taking notes for him. Personality, oh, he's great. He's, uh, it's his big smile, which is the winning thing, I think. Uh, he's got, his face is sort of naturally shaped into a smile, but it isn't, it isn't a forced thing, because, I mean, it reflects his personality. He's got that little bit of, little bit of a devil in him, really, as well. Like, you know, so. I'm Rich. I am a student, I'm a third year student at Staffordshire Uni doing film. I met Tom through the Christian Union. We were in the same Bible study group, so I got to know him through there. And then I think we just started talking and hanging out, and I just progressed as the years went on. I've known him for about, well, two years, so two and a bit years. Yeah, it certainly um, brings other issues to light. You think about all those doors at the university you've got to walk through, and Tom's there in his wheelchair and he can't move these doors and you think, oh gosh, if I was in a wheelchair it would be so much harder. You do kind of think about it and what you'd do if you were in that situation, so yeah. When I come and see Tom, uh, normally make sure he has his medication, obviously make sure he has lots of drinks and just basically just a chat, so just see how he is and that, so. Just a normal guy who's living in the uni, studying and having fun. And then sometimes, and uh, get them through life.